All right, guys, so I've had a few messages about Bitcoin.com and using them as a Bitcoin cash mining pool. Well, let's get right to it. Um, if you want to go ahead and sign up, you would have a button right here. I have go to dashboard because I already signed up. Um, but when you sign up, it's literally going to ask you for a username, a password, and a Bitcoin wallet address. You can do it now, or you can do it once you go into the account settings. Um, you can see that there's 0% fees. You see your block reward. Go ahead and sign up, and let's go to that dashboard. So once you're in this dashboard, you're going to have all your different settings on the left. Let's ignore that. You can stay in your dashboard, which is right here. If you ever need to navigate back to it, it's right here in the top left-hand side, right under your name. You can see I'm currently at 41 terahash per second, just because I'm, I'm trying out a couple different machines on different mining pools to see how they work out, see what type of profits I'm getting back, and to really see what's the best. You know, not to just take other people's words for it and really just get the real information. So what you need to do to start mining is you need to use your username, which you see right here. Password, you must put a password or it cannot be blank. Your username must be lowercase. Guys, it must be lowercase. Make sure that that is taken care of. Now, your URL for Bitcoin, if you want to do Bitcoin, all right, would be right here. And if you wanted to do Bitcoin Cash, it'll be right here. And if you want to do for BTC, BCH, Auto Profit, it would be right here. All right, we're going to go do a stratum BCH. So let's copy this. Let's go to our AntMiner's GUI interface. And you can see we're already in the minor configuration. But if you were not, you'd go to System. That would be your usual start page. You'd go to Minor Status. Sorry, not Minor Status minor configuration and right here you would enter in your pool and then your worker as you see we have the worker here with this exact name minor digi dot time digi three and then the password one two three then the same thing and the same thing and the same thing you can copy and paste but I've already done it guys I'm just redoing it for you to give you the information hit save and apply so this is going to put me down for a couple seconds but I'll connect And you'll see that you'll be hashing. That's it. Quick, simple, easy. I hope this helps you guys. And good luck hashing.